That is I'm in town. Uh, I got this in my hands. And the storm is heavily, heavily coming. And I'm heading to Villa Found, see? Uh, the rain is coming, coming, coming. I need to, I need to run. Construction is going on at Villa Found, raising the last two courses, then roofing. Ah, uh, man, I really need to rush. I really do need to rush. Guys, I've left town. I'm at uh, Villa Found area now. So I want you guys to see the kind of progress that has been made at Villa Found. New shape of Villa Found, guys. I'm from town. I want you to see what has happened here. We are still pushing with water here. Mkofiti. See guys, that. Guys, our blocks are over. Ime baki ya wapi na wapi? Ime baki ya wapi na wapi? Aha. Apo dani? Aha. Apa? Apo? Bara ni la ni bi? Aha. Mina ni moja moja. Moja moja. Zoni ma weka manga wapi? Guys, even cement is over, man. Wow, because next is roofing, guys. So right now they are measuring a uh, roof. The timber we need. I up here i don't even know how these people <laughs> went up there because you cannot now go up i don't know how to go up but only a small area has remained for blocks right there right there right here right there and right there Oh, guys, I don't even know how to go up anymore. <laughs> but see how everything has come out, man. Super lovely. And it's raining where I came from just now. 
See that, see that guy. See that guy. See that. See that. Wow. wow. Let me go up, right? So I give you an aerial view. The only place which has remained with blocks to put blocks is right here, right here, and right there, and right there ahead, like 40 blocks. But the entire house, the two courses, and one one is thumbs up. So we'll wait, we see when next we will be able to facilitate some work because cement is over blocks are over we can't use these small ones those ones they are trash maybe for fixing small gaps like this quarter stone wow it's a little bit windy the storm is coming look at that I kept seeing guys, two courses, two courses of Talinto, look now, two courses done, two courses done, completely done, look. So we'll finish the other part finish the other part when we are doing timber work or putting timber for roof. Better we do that when we are doing timber work. And also these parts. so we can at least get the land of timber we need New look of Villa found, guys. We are even calculating iron sheets. The number of iron sheets I'll, I'll be required to buy. <laughs> the stuff. <laughs> Why? Guys, hey, we've reached the iron sheet part, man. What? No, my son. Joint, 
Nada, no hice la vaca. Buena, no. Buena, no ni la coja, yo. Coco, yo hago lo mismo. Guys, see what is needed here for roofing. Timber long 17, timber long 16, timber long 17, nails, iron sheets, even stones, man. This is very scary, man. Wow. Anyway, guys, me, I'll deal with that. Anyway, we'll be found. Next stage is roofing. You see that, guy? You see that? Can you see that? Super, super nice. Good morning, guys. I'm eating ground nuts. At Villa Found area, I just arrived. So see the new look of Villa Found from here. This is a small school right here for kids. See the new look of Villa Found. It looks super, super pretty. We've been really working. So someone might ask, why is the area around your fence yellow? It's because we sprayed herbicides to kill all the weeds and grass inside. And yesterday we did fence this part. You see? So nobody can go through in. Now you have to use the gate, which is right here. We also fenced this other part. No more trespass here. You see? Right there. And we also fenced Tasa. And we also fenced right here. This other corner. So no more trespass. You see? So here, when we lock the gate, you have to use our gate otherwise no entry so if we lock the gate no entry from any other corner you, you come in like that and you close the gate our water is still running let me see the amount of water we've used so far ah, guys here construction is water so if you're planning to build have a whole ocean with you 36,810 36, liters since we began building and you see the new shape of Villa Farm let me zoom in for you guys so we built these stands here so we'll not remove them anytime soon because they will give us support when we are doing roofing we still need to be on top and also when we are doing the third course for villa found okay so we have some space right there brother james hola hola my brother my brother james loves honda and he said the space right there exactly at the front door the other space there we make it a bathroom very nice bathroom so we are really pushing here and doing our best our tank still has water on top right there and here we poured these uh, stuffs here so at least water used to like gather here and make something dirty so we put this that so at least everything can be okay here 
we burned all that and these things are it's like they are growing again they're turning green so we'll spray them again with herbicide so you see what we did all around the house all around the house you see I usually kept on singing. We are doing two courses past the lint or two courses. Now we are done. So right now I'm singing roofing, roofing, guys. I'm singing roofing, roofing. And we'll finish roofing very, very soon. Very, very soon. So you see. So unless you go up here, that's when you'll be able to have an aerial view of Villa Found. Otherwise, at the ground, you can't see anything. See how it looks inside. So timber is very, very important in construction. Otherwise, you'll have a very, very rough time without timber. So what we are doing is we are putting water on the newly built courses. So it doesn't crack. Look at the beautiful axe that we made. So right there, we're still gonna put blocks. Right here, we'll still put blocks. Right there, we'll still put blocks. And right here, we have a small section without blocks. You see, and also right there. So when we put blocks, the entire uniform, the entire house becomes uniform, and we cleaned everything. So this space, my bro says, we can make a very, really good bathroom right here. So we'll figure about that, bro, soon. Kochonjo? Ni kochonjo sana. So we do that to prevent cracking really good you see that so it's a whole lot of water being used at least that I'm to get a bell ski come out at a at least I'm to get a bell ski come out at a go this is my because I got I cleaned the entire floor yesterday. Look, super clean. Looks good. You see, places like here we used half blocks. You see, pure half blocks. So here we're gonna put two courses so it becomes uniform. The entire unit house becomes uniform. There's barely any blocks left in this compound, see? That's some water being splashed on the blocks. So the blocks that remained, we really did push them to this other side. This is actually a small shower room. This one right here. To be shared between bedroom one and bedroom two. Share, we'll share this shower room here. You see? So this will be a very small, comfortable shower room. So we put half blocks here. So this, we'll still use them. Nothing goes to waste in construction nothing goes to waste in construction so everything gets water so i wanna go up so i show you what's going on here can i let reflect aqua green green can i let reflect aqua green reflector i put an idea so let me first use this ladder. This ladder, I don't know what happened. It broke into two by the bottom. And yesterday we got a new machete. 
for for the villa. Look, it's a new one. We got it. We got it at three USD. So let me give you an aerial view from this ladder because otherwise, unless. Now, from here you can see there's need to be an extension of blocks like that, one course only, and like that one course, the other side one course. Because now the entire unit, this, this side is actually uniform, my left is actually uniform. And the blocks are still wet, that's why they look blackish. But once we stop like putting water like that, you see, you're putting water there, everything will turn whitish after some time. So this is actually very rigid and we left some gaps like that for placing timber. So that's the new look of my dream house right here in Africa it looks super duper I've really been doing a lot I've really been doing a lot to push this dream of mine you see we need very long timbers to fix here so don't say we put space in the blocks no so the other course which we'll build on top of this will be for beauty and that would cut across inside it's just around the house that will just be for beauty purpose only actually that we can put after we've put roofing so that it becomes easier because if you add another course right here from the scaffold right there it will be very difficult to reach here Welcome, 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 welcome. Wow. It looks super cute. Good morning from Africa, Kenya. This is Ian here. Today it's a bright, bright morning and I am feeling super cool. I'm downed in a green reflector today. <laughs> ah, the sun is too bright, guys, on my face. So I don't have to like keep looking at the sun. Anyway, what I want to do is, is to give you a full, complete house tour of uh, this dream called Villa found here. So our compound looks super great like that and this gate still needs to be repaired this pillar i've said that many times on my vlogs and we'll do that as we are doing the wall perimeter wall around okay so right now we fenced both entries that were here so you have to use the main gate so if you're going in Without permission is trespass. So welcome. We're really trying our best and we're really, really, really like uh, making all efforts going into Villa Found right now. And one step at a time, for those who've been following the progress, it's been really a lot of work. So welcome. And you see the new look. The new look. Of Villa found is like this you see how it looks like it looks super cute uh, from here if you look behind me you can be able to see can you see that let me go a little bit forward so like I said yesterday it took a new look so that's the new look 
and the new shape of this dream villa found I love this helmet it feels so comfortable being in it so right there in these corners we'll put if you guys have seen Diana Kemi's house you'll see some design on these corners so that's what we're gonna put also in our house but a different design not same same okay so right here in these corners we'll put those small small designs that make makes a house look beautiful you know so we are really really doing our best now the next part is roofing for those who have been singing that roofing is really indeed the hardest part of construction uh, I'm here to prove you wrong all right so with time because next week <laughs> will be dedicated to next week will be purely dedicated my beards are growing I don't like them so I'm gonna cut them off so I'm, I'll really be putting you into test to see whether roofing is really the hardest part of construction so I'll really be doing that but I can confirm because from what I'm planning and budgeting for roofing is something out of this world so can really be 80% on your side to say that roofing is hard but it's not as hard as lintel guys roofing is hard lintel is hard and foundation that is one thing nobody can convince me about so about landscaping we'll have a couple right there right there is gonna be a couple you see right there our carport is gonna be right there and right here will be lanes of grass lanes of grass two lanes of grass and a walk path that's the whole idea right here and then by the perimeter wall we're gonna put some good good really nice flowers so right now we are watering the walls so at least everything can be rigid you see right there it's a whole lot of water being used to put the walls rigid construction without water is doomed not valid still need like a whole ocean with you you see that super super nice so we are really trying our best and this rope of ours, not rope, I mean this pipe of ours has been really helpful since we bought it day one. It has really, really helped a lot here in the farm. Looks like the storm is gonna be coming anytime soon. Look at the clown. My friends in Florida, I hope everything is okay because hurricane, I don't know hurricane what. Actually, I don't know the difference between hurricane and tornado. I'm going to be looking that up online to see the difference. And on Sunday, we're going to have a live stream. On Sunday, today is Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Sunday, we have a live stream. So three days to live stream. No, two days. Because today is Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Then next week, we'll be talking about roofing. So we really need... A live stream so at least we can update some friends of how everything is running so today is gonna be raining definitely so guys construction is really really a lot of work you guys have watched all episodes since day one since we bought this since we started everything here and we are pushing, we are pushing, pushing. 
you know look at that man me what i knew <laughs> i knew we were gonna be stuck putting the two courses up past linto because things were getting really really tough on my side especially financially <sighs> but we have people like brother james who came through for us and we did the two courses and i'm really really grateful big shout out to my brother james sir jp we're gonna ride with the honda up to here from the city man when you come to kenya bro <laughs> we're gonna pick a honda up to here man so this really this small extension right here was supposed to be an extension of like this house here but we really kicked it out we really did kick it out so it was left bare like that it will really have consumed a lot of blocks because blocks going up like this and like this and like that we really have used very very many blocks guys in these uh, supporting things timbers like this we had planned for them to be for roofing but look hey my friends construction things go shagana bagala you don't even understand because see timber like this is supposed to be for roofing you see but uh, since you need supporting beams you see like timber like this this is called three by two you see three by two three by two so this three by two you still use it in other places which is not for roofing and this one mind you this one will be here because <laughs> this one will be here because when we are roofing we still need to be above the house so this will be removed after roofing so you see how it gets negative it gets negative so you see another one right here you know another one right here but this one looked a little bit weak because it has some like black spots and it looks like it's gonna cut <laughs> so you see right there that's what we're doing right here wow you guys had waited for for this arc now that's how that arc look like looks like There's music playing right there, so I wanna go around where music is not playing. See how everything looks like. So I'm just giving you a tour. This is kitchen. That's dining. So right here. This is too big. This space is too big. He was calling it a store which is right next to the master bedroom. feels super nice here you can really really do take a really good selfie if you want selfie you see so my friends we're really doing hard i know roofing is gonna take like another whole week of non-stop work fast talk of first week is placing timber say five days or four days placing timbers say another three days of putting iron sheets ah bro it's crazy it's crazy man that will really really take a lot 
I talked to a few friends and I told them I feel like giving up because it's a lot bro, it's a lot. And if I complain, I'm usually like to my edge, like man I can't do anything here by myself. So that's the aerial review. Imagine a whole from Monday to Wednesday putting two courses around the house. And imagine we need another 200 blocks to, pl to put dry right there. Ah, it's a lot, guys. It's a lot. But anyway, we keep pushing. So my phone is off. I'm charging my phone. Uh, my GoPro says 13%. No, 32%. Guys, I'm looking for an extra GoPro battery. Guys, in case you have two, please you can lend me one. Or you can plan to sell for me one GoPro battery, man. Because I'm really on the edge. And I'm in, I'm in dire, dire need. I'm in dire need of... Uh, battery so this pipe i bought a very lengthy pipe see from it goes around the house there's no way it doesn't reach and these supporting beams here are very 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 nice so when we was building you heard these guys speaking a lot of native language and you are wondering hey what are these guys talking about they really do talk their own stories they talk about their lives and everything. See how master bedroom special it is. Me, what I'm really eagerly waiting for is the interior design of the house. Because the exterior will really come with its own time. So these beams here will be here for as long as possible. Until the end of times until we do plaster here amen so this expect this to be here for a very very long time Where kijana abu toka enda shule sahi ama nishuke hapo na kiboko toka mbio rudi shule nakupata hapo sahi that kid is supposed to be in class not construction site so we really need to be putting our get close because kids in a construction site can really land you in very very much much trouble so you have to be very very keen also some of them come here saying they want i don't know what but things to do with kids no me no they can land you in trouble say they drink water from your tap and they get sick they'll say you gave the kid water and they got sick so you'll be blamed guys that is it beautiful view villa found we really still need to like um organize our ballast here we'll reorganize it i saw a friend saying we need to reorganize our ballast so we're gonna do that See all the sand we had is now over except for the one right there that corner in the dining so here you can really walk comfortably wow we put put a lot of water on the walls you see it's turning white Meaning cement and sand in the mortar ratio was okay. Because this really needs to be strong. Because this will be withstanding all the wind, all the wind force and all the rain force. So it really has to be strong. Super, super strong. Also that beam right there. We really did put a lot of cement. You see now it's supporting itself. That's a very lengthy metal we put right there. You guys saw us putting uh, the beams. 
So we are putting water round, 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 round. So we are really doing our best. I'm suspecting that guy. He's working with corn. I really suspect him. He's stolen them somewhere. <laughs> you need to go to my grass. <laughs> what So no work at Villa found until next week. That's when we're gonna be having some activity here. Probably Monday. Monday, 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 Funday. So we can walk to town and we see what's happening in town because there's pretty no activity here uh, the only update is that we are really looking forward to putting roof at villa farm guys and it's really gonna be tough on my side for iron sheets and timber it's gonna take a whole lot imagine iron sheets will take over 300 usd iron sheets over 300 usd and timber over 200 so that's just like 500 plus imagine over 500 roofing alone but once we roof we'll be 90 percent done with the house because the next will be like fixing window grills plaster those are simple things putting electric pipes plaster that's simple simple but still tough so next week we'll start fa first by putting blocks here like that like that imagine over 500 usd just through finger man it's a lot it's a lot it's a lot Sometimes I do complain, but me, I have a few friends. <laughs> when I feel like complaining, all I just do, I call them <laughs> and I tell them I cried. <laughs> I cried alone, and you know me, sometimes I like crying, 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 crying. I want to go down, and the only way to go down is through this window, window chamber here. You really can't go down in any other way. I have an avocado with me here. Uh, I really... uh. oh. So that is it guys. So roofing will take us over 500 USD. Imagine especially iron sheets iron sheets are crazy expensive man everything construction is expensive i remember i used to cry cry even when we was in cost three of building now i am crying crying even in roofing but as we still keep pushing with the little we have no stopping so guys i think i'll take you guys to town <laughs> So we see what's popping in town because no much activity at Villa found anyway. So yes, this guy gave me an avocado, but I'll feel it anyway. So wow, welcome to Villa found, guys. So that's the new look and that's the house tour. So another quick house tour is bedroom one, bathroom, bedroom two. In that end living area dining kitchen master bedroom and a store but we have ideas popping up as time goes by we have ideas popping by so you're gonna maybe see some changes with time 
so welcome still at home and i'll see you around okay see you around Guys, we're gonna put such a beautiful space yard in Villa Found with flowers. So greetings guys, I'm um, actually in town, leaving this small mini mall. Uh, There's a lot of people with vehicles here. So I'm heading uh, out to town and the storm looks like it's coming. I'm actually going store by store to ask and inquire about price of uh, price of iron sheets. So I wanna go to the farthest end of uh town Ooh. storm is coming guys i'm going down 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 to the farthest edge of town i wanna go ask price of uh iron sheets so i'm going to a store which i know sells cheap <laughs> so i'm gonna have do you guys remember where we got our uh, steel steel bath last time? That's the place I'm heading to. And we got the steel bath in a pink in a pink um, truck. I think I once used this truck for transport. KDB023Z. Storm is coming. What you always have to do is go store after store after store after store to ask for price of items. We are actually indeed in the roofing part of Villa Found and uh, it's really 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 needing a lot. I will confirm to you guys if indeed roofing is the hardest part of construction. 
because I've been told that by very many people. Others keep saying, oh, I don't know, finishing is hard, I don't know what. Me, I'll give you guys a whole summary <laughs> after I finish. My honest opinion of things. So down, down to the farthest edge of town. have a base right there that sells roasted meat or barbecue I'm not sure so I'm going to ask for price of iron sheets oh guys this place can really really get cold I actually want to do cross the road and we have a 1960 vehicle left over here and tall building in town so let me actually cross here you have to be super careful man otherwise you'll have a very very rough time cyclists of town okay okay mr truck and a high lux 4x4 rome overlanding cruiser so this is nyahururu town typically and the store we are heading to to look for materials is just right here and if you guys remember, I bought our gate right here, right here. And I'm actually gonna come to the same, same spot looking for window grills. Right, right here. Right there. So far, let's go and ask about iron sheet. It's pretty getting cold here. Seems like the storm is gonna be going down. In the next, let's see one now. Look at the clouds. And this road heads to Nairobi. Nairobi, Kenya. Three hours of non stop traveling at 60 miles an hour. And you're arriving in the big, big city. I really did feel like I would want to have a a short break and tour there but a lot of things hindered me from so guys let me go we are going right there to ask for price of uh, too many motorbikes kenya is a country of bikers and we have a very big police truck here we are heading right there to ask for price of items police truck Bolivia, Bolivia. Seems it's going left. I'm not so sure. See that? Whoa! Let's go and ask. See here, they even sell beds, seats, etc. It started drizzling already. See you in a short bit, guys. through town I've already asked for the price of uh, 
iron sheets and I'm telling you it's not vegetable <laughs> pretty much moving cars and exhausters it's a lot of work my GoPro front screen is on I love it off because when it's off guys can you see that that's the vehicle i used to teach uh, myself driving i enrolled to that school for driving storm is coming real quick and heavy i'm moving to the upper section of town and i'm also looking for something to eat at least I also want to pass by another store right there to ask for price of iron chips. It's better to ask things for yourself because if you wait for hearsay, you have a very very rough time understanding price of materials. Looking for materials is not easy, man. Three big trucks following each other. So right there in that building, we have a store that sells construction stuff. So that's where I want to go. Ask for price of material. I own sheet. Can you see that vehicle with a hundred chicken on its top? Local town, local local, everything local local. And people still promote their business with music. And many motorbikes. Can you see this guy stopped his his scooter in the middle of the road? Can you see? <laughs> and see he's posing in the middle of the road <laughs> and he caused a scene. Let me cross. That guy stopped in the middle of the road. <laughs> he looks crazy. Look at that. So let me ask uh, here right here so guys i picked uh, my list of uh, items here of uh, iron sheets wow. big 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 things so i'm actually moving around town store by store to check prices of everything <laughs> it's crazy man crazy see all these stuff bro I mean, two meters, 720, two and a half, 900. Ha. Man, it's a lot. <laughs> well, anyway, guys, let me cross the road because I need to. I need to cross the road. I get you. So let's cut across this street here.
Guys, I'm still looking for something to eat. Someone asked, camera ni anini? He's asking, camera is for what? <laughs> oh, oh, me, I don't talk to people in the street <laughs> because I don't do interviews. <laughs> oh, oh, I move. Guys, it's drizzling. I need to get to my eating spot real quick. I have my list of what we need here for roofing, man. And I'm telling you the price is on another level. What? Right, we are planning for construction. And you, and you know your plan is not planning. You just eat that money. <laughs> You eat chapati and mandas because it can really, really get rough with the construction. So me, I move around. I want to go somewhere right there to to eat. Oh, there's a new there's a new hotel right here called Sherry's Sherry's Hotel. Oh, I didn't know about this. Guys, can we try the new hotel right here? like there's a new hotel here oh wow see 